Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today is Tuesday and I didn't get to film anything this morning. I was kind of having a slow allergy morning. So I am barely getting to vlogging, but I have a busy day full of errands um, ahead of me. But something I wanted to talk about because it's on my mind and because you know, you talk from what's going on in your life. Uh, when other people don't believe in you, it's okay. Like, they weren't with you the entire time into coming into whatever it is you're pursuing. And if other people don't believe in you, like, that's okay. You have to believe in yourself. Don't worry about what anybody else says. Don't worry about their opinions. Don't worry about, you know, if they doubt you, don't let that make you doubt yourself. You just, you keep believing in yourself and what you know is true. And, you know, if you pursue your passion and you pursue what you're trying to do with every bit of your being, it's going to happen. So that's, that's what's on my mind. And I thought I'd share that. So, yeah, <laughs> I have no idea what today's vlog is going to be about, but that's what I wanted to get across to you guys today. Believe in yourself every single day with all of your being. Hey guys, so I just got home. Today was a very long day. I did not even get to vlog at all. It's pretty much just on my computer all day long. But I wanted to share with you guys what I'm about to eat because I'm so far behind on macros. And Chase shared with me a very awesome peanut butter uh, shake recipe that he made. This is the cookies and cream protein by Proceps that I'm actually gonna use. It's leftover protein that we bought from like a year ago. <laughs> so good. All right, so I'm gonna scan it. Maybe, there we go. Scan it, and then with these, I always like to make sure it's the same. So two carbs, 21 protein. Two carbs, 21 protein. So I'm actually going to do two scoops because I'm so far behind, not 23 two scoops because I'm so far behind on protein. So two scoops and then I'm gonna do protein, er, peanut butter, excuse me. Okay, so that puts me three over. So what I'm gonna do is just do two, oh, excuse me, 1.5. And so what you can do too is if like you're weighing your peanut butter differently, um, you can use fluid ounces and just do the fluid ounces so like one fluid ounce is the equivalent to two tablespoons so I could do 0.5 which gives me one tablespoon so I'll do that actually I might do a full tablespoon so one full ounce still three over three is not bad though I think I'll leave it at that and see, I still have 30 carbs and 13 protein. Um, I think I need to add some cashew milk. There we go, so 150 milliliters. Um, I'll measure that the same as grams, so I'll just weigh it out in grams. One fluid ounce peanut butter, or one table, two tablespoons, and 52 grams of this cookies and cream Proceps protein powder. So, we will see how this goes. I know it's gonna taste really good because Chase has made it and I fell in love with it when I had it. So, um, if you don't have a Nutribullet, I do recommend getting a Nutribullet. Or I hear the, the Ninjas are actually pretty good too, so you can use a Ninja too. YouTube. Are you gonna drink it? Well, duh. <laughs> <laughs> I have like a lot of macros left, so. Okay, so when I make mine, and I'm gonna make one now too, because I need one, is I use two scoops. Okay. One ounce. Peanut butter. So one scoop is 26. Get out of the way. Of I didn't know you were recording. Right I just told you I'm doing it for YouTube. Don't be weird. <laughs> You gotta at least say hi. What's up, YouTube? What's up, YouTube? <laughs> Coming from the side? 
They saw your head. They saw your head. <laughs> I'm up from the bottom. You know, then you're going to be, oh, wait, so two, so two, okay, so 26 and 26. Quit being weird. What about from the top? Comment below if you think Chase and I should start a couple YouTube channel. <laughs> Are you weighing the protein powder? Yes. Consistency is key. Left. That is not a spoon. Give me a spoon. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm, peanut butter is so good. All right. And then because I know that I have a little bit of protein left, I have 13 grams of protein left to eat instead of making a whole nother meal. I'm just going to put in the egg whites, the amount that will equal out to however many I have left. I have 13 grams of protein left. So let's see if I can make this show. So right here where it says protein, I'm going to try and make that number hit 13 by changing this number. So 25, 13.6 check let's see if it makes it go so I'm negative one so I can actually do like 120 grams it's 13 even and boom there we go so I'm gonna add 120 grams of egg whites it just makes it creamy it's not gross it doesn't make it taste nasty or anything it just makes it more creamy Yeah, I don't know if y'all heard that. Shard out. Shard out. <laughs> oh I can't. I can't even. <laughs> um, shout out to Mark Lobliner. Is that how you say it? Lobliner. Lobliner. Shout out to Mark Lobliner. Because we were watching his live feed one time on Insta Snap and he was talking about his favorite protein shake, which is this shake right here. And so that's where we got the recipe from. We should weigh out our ice too. I'm just kidding. My God, come out. Ready. Don't laugh guys, I don't know what I'm doing. not to make a protein shake. <laughs> I think now it's too full cool because there's liquid coming out. Oh no, here we go. This is, we got it. Yeah. Chill. Pillar. Okay. And where's your fancy cups that you always put your shakes in? Whoops. You need a bowl for that. You made freaking ice cream. I made a protein ice cream. Mm. It's good though. And voila. Whoop. And voila. This is how you make a protein protein ice cream shake thing. By Mark Lobliner. Alright. I hope you guys like this video. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys. I'll see you on tomorrow's vlog. And we out of here.